every oyster you'll see has like a V shape, yeah? All very different, yes? Very different. Ooh, this is but this is where we're going to put the knife in a little place called the sweet spot, believe it or not. <laughs> so we call that the sweet spot from there to about there. A little area from there to there, in there. The knife is held at an angle of about 35 to 45 degrees. If you're right-handed, we put on the left-hand side of that V there. Just in there. And it's actually two motions. It's very gentle. So it's a rocking motion. One this way and one this way. There's no screwdriver effect, please. If you do it like a screwdriver, which a lot of people do, you crush shell. That shell goes inside the meat. And what do you have to do? You've got to wash it. That's rule number one. We don't wash oysters. Yeah? Can you show me that movement again? I'm just taking a photo. So we need to go one against the other, yeah? Okay. So that, nice and gentle, against the knife. Yeah, yeah. nice and gentle. But I want to show you how much of this blade I use. Now, my thumb covers most of the blade. Hence, earlier I said don't buy knives with guards on them, yeah? Because yeah. your thumb is restricted. Uh, okay. You can't move in there. Yeah. Your thumb reaches there and that whole blade is exposed. And if you slip, no well, you'll soon know about it, believe me. And I've seen knives go through guys' hands. Yeah? I've seen a lot of tendons severed, and it's not yeah. a pretty sight. 